I'm Rahul, a cloud support engineer at the AWS office in Bangalore. Today, I'll be walking you through how you can migrate your network traffic from a Direct Connect virtual interface associated with a virtual private gateway to a Direct Connect gateway with minimum downtime. Let's get started. First, we must create a new Direct Connect gateway. From the AWS Management Console, navigate to the Direct Connect Console. Select Direct Connect Gateways from the Navigation panel. Then, choose Create Direct Connect Gateway and enter the name and AS number for the Amazon side of the Border Gateway Protocol session. Next, we'll create a new private virtual interface and associate it with the Direct Connect Gateway. From the Navigation panel, choose Virtual Interfaces. Select Create Virtual Interface. Select Private and enter the name of the virtual interface. Now select the physical Direct Connect connection where you want the new virtual interface to be provisioned. For virtual interface owner, choose My AWS Account if the virtual interface is for your account. For gateway type, choose Direct Connect Gateway and then select the Direct Connect Gateway that was created earlier. Fill in the rest of the fields and then choose Create Virtual Interface. Next, we'll associate the Virtual Private Gateway that is already attached to your VPC with the Direct Connect Gateway. From the Navigation panel, select Virtual Private Gateways. Choose the Virtual Private Gateway that is associated with your VPC and then choose Direct Connect Gateway Associations tab. Choose Associate Direct Connect Gateway tab. Select My Account under Association Account Type and then choose the Direct Connect Gateway from drop-down menu. Optionally, you can also specify the list of prefixes to be allowed to be advertised to on-premise networks through the Direct Connect Gateway. Click on Associate Direct Connect Gateway. Optionally, you can pre-stage the configuration on your network device for the new virtual interface associated with the Direct Connect Gateway. Configure a longer AS path attribute on the same prefix that is advertised over BGP peering on the new virtual interface. By doing this, the outbound traffic from AWS to on-premise network continues to prefer the existing virtual interface route, which has a shorter AS path prepend. For example, in the diagram, the on-premise prefix 10.0.0.0 forward slash 8 is advertised over the existing virtual interface with an AS path prepend of 1, while the same prefix is advertised over the new virtual interface, which in turn is attached to the Direct Connect Gateway with an AS path prepend of 3. Also, make sure that traffic from your network still leaves from the existing virtual interface and not from the newly created Direct Connect Gateway virtual interface using the local preference BGP attribute on your network device. During the maintenance window, manually bring down the BGP session for the existing virtual interface on your network device. When the routes are reconverged, traffic will fail over to the new virtual interface that is associated with the Direct Connect Gateway. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.